I had. So I wanted to do something where other people could learn about what other job seekers were learning about this whole process. And uh, you know, when we have those other uh, networking, you'll find that they'll have names that we made up for them, okay, so it'll align with their job description. And I do have uh, the contract position may not be what a lot of us are looking for. They had a half a day to give him the training. Wow. So simply by saying to work every day, knowing that he's going to do that with all of their shops, he was unemployed for eight months. And we always tend to feel, you know, nothing's happening here. What's wrong? Is it about me? Is it how come they let you? Many of you have too. Is you just kind of out of um, cocoon? Don't feel like going out and going to those Christmas parties. The journey. He found that volunteering was really important. The Catholic Church runs the mission. You know, that's kind of a cool deal. I, I did learn a lot of things, and just focusing on the blessings that they have is really important to them. Mm -hmm. Not on Wall Street anymore, but he's got more time with his family. He's got a really exciting group of people to work with, and so great stuff for him. Marketing Mary, they had a, she had interviewed for a job as a project conference to do some other job searches in other areas. And like you say, he was never really having to search for a job himself. So this was a big change for him. And he did land a contract job after five months. Again, another contract job for, his, for the Tuesday morning meetings. That helps you get going, but there's some days you just don't want to do that. She was a human resources manager, didn't want to be a manager anymore. He learned about it. Just, they'll help you be more confident, you'll look better, because you have the answer to the recycling program here in Fort Collins, right? So how much money do you make? And there's a purpose, you know, just helps you out there 12 months, 15 months, things like that. But when she did get in a funk, right, that maybe they used from the last time they filled a position like this, the hiring manager may or may not have been that active in writing that job description. So by writing this other thing down, that she thought, and over and over again, I hear people say that paid off for me. Um, about postings that are on monster.com because that is really a frustrating event, and it's just really hard to to say and be positive with family members when they ask questions at a bad time. She had been a project manager before. She had. To, Keep going, you know, even in the bad economy, people are getting hired. You know, you watch the news and dog, it can be really depressing, but that's what sells the news, is those kinds of things. Uh, the economy's gonna get better. Uh, we're all looking, the ups and downs are really fairly constant and very often, and you're right, but she has this very diverse background. She opened up her horizons. And now, uh, uh, one interview, that was the only interview she had to do and she was in the position. Uh, yeah, she got that call on the Monday morning, she interviewed in the afternoon, got the job on Wednesday, started the job on that earlier work for you. But uh, once he had that, his resume, had this stuff well rehearsed, he could visualize the cards in front of him when they asked him the question about, you know, when was the last time that you made a part? And uh, his comment here is, I learned how giving people are. I think being a part of a networking group made me realize how much people give to each other, the greater time people who you are. You might be, I mean, in this economy, you almost, some of the diligence that you need to on the job stuff, right? If, they, uh, if you can understand what they need, what problem that you can solve for them, that's a good thing. Say, uh, you know, I understand that's a real feeling, but it's not the right time. Well, yeah, because he's learned so much about this whole process. And here's another tip. I don't know if I could call this a journey or a tip, but, you know, they offered the salary and uh, the, and that's a very sought after company that he landed. That's right. Modified role. <laughs> that is so true. This company always has this uh, they always company. And now they're just like star performers and you're not landed a job within a week just because they were out taking care of themselves. But it led to something else. So don't leave that part or something like that. Some people grieve for a long time, other people are uh, and have made it through. But just think about it, they faith a lot of times. Um, and they've got a whole new sense of empathy. You know, it's interesting when you got the cushy job, you know, and you're kind of going through things and you're acquiring things. So I'd like to hear from you in terms of what would you say would be some of the takeaways that you would learn from these people? I guess pride got in the way from him asking for help. Idol. You've had the pay, and I think that the biggest... Um, you know, I, I've only been out of work for four weeks, but I have this fear of maybe taking a job that isn't what I want. It ain't gonna work, you, you know. I see the interviews on television where they said, "Get somebody on a close-up." You know, I'll work for nothing, or you know. The chances are you do. aren't starting to be efficient for six to twelve months anyway. And I've experienced that firsthand with people I've worked with. Done correctly, yeah. There are two things that I've noticed, and I, I've been <clears throat> networking.
working with some job seekers for a long time now, and where, where someone is telling me what they said in an interview, and, and I think to myself, well, if I were the person who was doing the interview, they'd notice that, and they'll start apologizing for having done so. <laughs> Successful job seekers coming through this group, mm -hmm. or no, I know that we emphasize that here. You know, you, you can't just pray, oh God, please send me this job. You know, make it happen. Even then, at the end of it, I got the question from someone saying, "Correction, right? Because no matter how good you have it, you'll have a yacht and three homes, and you'll still be unhappy because it came to be taken up to this level of bliss. So every day he woke up. And add those things to your tool set. Fifth was that you. And uh, 